The French embassy in Ghana has held a three-day workshop for Ghanaian animators to network, share experiences and build connections with investors and big studios in France. The workshop was also to connect Ghanaian animators to potential distributors, funders and business opportunities in France. Also, Arai has more. Attended by some of Ghana's leading animators and content producers, the three-day workshop afforded participants the opportunity to exchange ideas, learn and network. The meeting was also to expose talents to modern industry trends and most importantly link them to distributors and opportunities in France. Ni Ofei Dodo is a promising Ghanaian 2D animator and co-founder of Indigen Bros. Beyond you collaborating with other people from other parts of the world and showcasing what you have, what are you looking forward to? Basically networking. Networking meets potential distributors to showcase our work out there. Animators usually have a big problem with financing, uh, collaboration, and basically trying to get the exposure out there. But given the work that the French Embassy has done, we had the opportunity to get some exposure out there. This festival is an opportunity for us to also meet other animators and also bridge that gap in collaboration. Other participants expressed gratitude to the French Embassy for the exposure. With Animax FYB Studios, we are the leading animation studio in Ghana, not just in Ghana, in West Africa. And um, one of the things that we've come to notice that is our major challenge is capacity and also distribution channels. So with this, we are going to ride on the backs of big studios that are already having big distribution channels in Europe, not just in France and um, push our content to the diaspora and also find a way to build our internal distribution channels. Sitembiso Mfele is a South African animation trainer and content producer. There's still a lot of work that needs to be done. Building communities where we can exchange information, share skills with each other will take us to the next step. The fourth industrial revolution, which is animation, gaming, just tech innovation, that literally puts Africa in a good position because you know we've gone through the most in our history. But now that we have this, it could jumpstart us into another phase where we can compete globally. And so the biggest thing for us to do is to literally do what we're doing here today.